Well, good morning, good morning, good morning, and praise be to God. Welcome to Empowering Word Christian Center. Welcome to Empowering Word Christian Center's Friday morning prayer. I'm Pastor Alvin White. We're going to get started here in just a moment. But in the meantime, I want you to love and share this, send this out, text somebody, inbox somebody, let somebody know that it is time to pray. Glory be to God. So we're going to start here in just a moment. But let somebody know that it's time to pray. Text somebody, inbox somebody. Let somebody know that it is time to pray. It's Friday morning prayer and prophetic service. Glory be to God. God is going to speak. We're going to pray. We're going to pray and God's going to speak. Amen. So we're going to start here in just a moment. Text somebody, inbox somebody, love and share this. Put this on your timeline, put it in a group, send it out. Praise God. Good morning, good morning, good morning, praise God. Good morning to you, Erica Tucker and Rhonda Herring. Good morning to you guys. 
Good morning, Elders Levi and Dawn Jones. Elders Stephen and Rochelle Taylor, good morning to you guys. Gretchen Hudson, good morning to you. Minister Marsha Wright, good morning to you. Linda Tripp, good morning to you. God bless you. Pastor Robert Carr, Elder Tracy Carr, good morning to you guys. Mary Bolden, good morning. Good morning to you. Dwight and Carolyn Moss, good morning to you guys. All right, praise God. Welcome to Empowering Word Christian Center. I'm Pastor Alvin White. And I'm Pastor Latoya. And welcome to Friday morning prayer and prophetic service, where we pray, we come together in agreement. We come together in the power of agreement, which is the greatest level of faith. You put your prayer request on the timeline. I promise you we will get to it. Amen. Put your prayer request on the timeline. I promise you we will get to it. We're going to be praying for things going on in the world, things going on in the body of Christ, things going on in the in our country, America, things going on regionally, things going on personally. We're going to be praying for all that stuff. Put your prayer requests on the timeline. I promise you we will get to it. If you feel like, hey, Pastor, let, let's pray for something. Let's pray for this. Let's pray for that. God put something in your heart. Put it on the prayer request. Put it on the timeline. We want to pray. If you've heard something going on in the news, whether it's locally, regionally, nationally, worldwide, you know, put it on the timeline so that we can pray. We can come together. Glory be to God. Amen. So let's go to the word of God. We're talking about the power of agreement. We're talking about the power of agreement. Matthew's Gospel, 18, 18 through 20, because I mentioned that the power of agreement is the greatest level of faith. Remember the Tower of Babel. Yes. Remember the Tower of Babel. Yes. I need you to remember the Tower of Babel. God came down. And he said, because they have one mind, yeah. there is nothing that they imagine to do that will be withheld from them. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah. That is one of the most wow scriptures in the Bible. Uh, look at uh, I'm, I'm going <laughs> to... I'm, I'm, I'm just trying to give you the word of the Lord. This is Genesis chapter 11. He says in verse 6, Genesis chapter 11, verse 6, And the Lord said, Indeed, the people are as one. Yes. And they have one language. And this is what they begin to do. And now nothing that they propose to do will be withheld from them. Come, let us, this is just like come, let us make man in our image. Come, let us go down and there and confuse their language that they may not understand one another's speech. This is one of the most wild instances in the history of history that mankind had one mind and one purpose, one focus, and that was to build this tower. This is right after the flood. This is right after the flood. And so, you have that. Yes, yes. Now, the next time we see something of this magnitude is in the book of Acts, where the Bible says they were all 
gathered in one accord. Yes, yes. One accord. So that's why we're coming together in the power of agreement. Make sure that you have somebody that you can pray with that truly has an agreeable heart. You don't want to be praying with somebody that that has strife and division and ill things in their heart with you. That's the truth. That's why spouses, you got to pray together. Glory be to God. Do more praying together and less bickering and, and, and arguing and, and fussing and fighting. You got to pray together. Glory be to God. Yeah, that's good. He says in Matthew. I'm going to say that again. Spouses, you got to pray together. Spouses, husbands, wives, pray together. Declare the word of God. Pray over your marriage together. Right then and there. Pray right over your marriage. And, and pray over the things that you know are coming against your marriage. Pray over communication. Come against uh, communication issues. Come against uh, outside interference, family issues. Come against heart issues. Things in your heart against each other. Uh, things in your heart that's causing issues in the marriage. Right then and there, together, pray. Pray. And you got to pray together, right? He says, I'm giving you the word of the Lord. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Um, he says, <clears throat> Matthew 18, looking at verse 18, Surely I say to you, whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven, and whatever you loose on earth will be loose in heaven. And again I say to you, if two of you agree on earth concerning anything, they ask, it will be done for them by my Father. For where two or three are gathered together in my name, I am there in the midst of them. Glory be to God. So, God is right here because we have the power of agreement. We have the power of agreement. Okay? So, we are praying and we are we are declaring that we're going to see these things come to pass. Glory be to God. Amen? Hallelujah. So, if you're single... Give one another, uh, you know, single woman with another single woman, uh, single man with another single man, praying over things, or um, a single man with a married man. Yes. Right? A single woman with a married woman praying together. Find somebody that, that can pray with you, but make sure that you are praying. Hallelujah. You've got to declare the word of God. You've got to speak the word of God. You've got to speak life. you got to say those things that be not as though they were. you got to speak the word. What did the centurion say? You don't have to come to my house, but speak the word only. Remember, death and life are in the power of the tongue. Glory be to God. So you got to speak the word. You got to speak the word. You got to declare the word. Amen. Um, uh, so that's what we're doing. That's what you have to do. You got to make sure that you're praying and declaring the word of God. Amen. 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 Are we Amen. ready to pray? Yes. Amen. Are we ready to pray? I want us to pray in the Holy Ghost. Start off praying in the Holy Ghost, and then we'll go from there. Are you ready to pray? Hallelujah. Let's pray. Pray in the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. 
Oh, Oh yeah, come on, pray in the Holy Ghost. If you need the infilling of the Holy Ghost, just say, Lord, fill me with your Holy Ghost. And begin to pray in the Spirit. Oh, Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Father, we just glorify you this morning. We magnify your holy name. We give you glory and honor and praise this morning, Lord. Yes. We love you this morning. We worship you this morning. We yes. lift up our hands mm. to worship you this morning. Mm. We bow down in our hearts to you. We surrender mm. to you, Father. All of you and none of us, Father. We yield to you. We yield to you. We yield to you, Father. Yes. As we pray and intercede this morning, Father, we pray from our righteous place, Father. Yes. The righteousness of God that was imputed upon us upon the cross, Father. And we know, Father, that your ears are attentive to the prayers of the righteous, mm. Lord. We forgive. We forgive, Father. Yes. We thank you, Lord, for your help, mm. your grace, and your mercy. As we release people, Father, that have done us wrong, we let them go and we give them over into your hands. We don't carry around hatred malignant issues, mm -hmm. ill wills towards people, Father. We let it go. We let it go. We let it go. Vengeance belongs to you, Father. And we release them. We release it and the situation onto you, Father. We let it go. We let it go. We let it go. We let it go in the name of Jesus, Father. So we just honor you, we bless you, we praise you, we surrender to you, Father. We exalt your holy name this morning. We magnify your holy name. We lift you up, Jesus. We lift you up, Jesus. And as we lift you up, all men are drawn unto you this morning, Father. Hallelujah. As we stand interceding and we partner in faith with your people, Father. As we link arms in faith with your people, Father, across this world, Father, we believe that we have what we say when we pray according to the will and the word of God because we have faith in God. We have the God kind of faith. Our words are rooted in the power of God. We believe that angels heed to the word of God when we pray. We believe that we have been given the keys of the kingdom of God because we believe that Jesus is the Christ, the son of the living God and the gates of hell. The gates of hell will not prevail against us. We believe that whatever we shall bind on earth is bound in heaven. We believe it. We believe it. We believe that whatever we shall loose on earth, it is loosed in heaven. We believe it in the name of Jesus. In the name of Hallelujah. Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Put your prayer request on the timeline. Oh, yeah. Put your prayer request on the timeline. Glory to God. Oh, 
Oh yeah, put your prayer request on the timeline. Glory, 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 glory. Oh, yeah, yeah, Marasata. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Gretchen Hudson says, pray for Marshawn that her cholesterol come in line with the word of God when she goes back to the doctor all is well. Father, we pray over Marshawn. We speak over her body right now in the name of Jesus. And we say, be thou regulated of cholesterol, the right numbers. We declare healing over her life, wisdom over her life. Salvation and blessing over her in the name of Jesus. Uh, let's see here. Gretchen says, pray for my nephew in Ohio. He had a stroke. His name is Ramon. Father, right now in the name of Jesus, we send the word of God to Ramon right now. And we say, be raised up and be healed. Lord God, in the name of Jesus, thank you for giving wisdom over the doctors and nurses. All the medication that's administered, let it do well with no evil side effects. Lord God, let Ramon have all capability of extremities, his face, his mouth, speech. Lord God, in the name of Jesus, let there be no issues or, or any effects of the stroke. And Lord God, thank you for healing and salvation over his life. And let him know that you did it. That you did it, Lord. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Yes, yes, good morning, Elijah and Alyssa Braddock. Good morning to you guys. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Good morning, Pat Walter. Glory be to God. Pat Walter says, pray against writing due to around... Uh, Oh, from the Proud Boys being found guilty of, yeah, seditious conspiracy. Yeah, the Proud Boys were found guilty. Praise God for that. And uh, we need to pray that there are no effects of that. Hallelujah. Um, she said, Liam, who nine, the brain tumor continues to grow back and the stents in his head need to be cleaned. He has gone through many operations, but he is able to see some colors. Praise the Lord. Father, we don't want this there anymore. This that 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 this is that we don't want this there anymore. Father, we rebuke it. We rebuke it by the root. By the root. By the root. In the name of Jesus. Spirit of infirmity, come out of this boy. In the name of Jesus. We declare healing and all tumors and cancers leave his body right yes, now. God. Healing in his body right now. In the name of Jesus. Good morning, Denise Pearson. God bless you. She says, please pray for increase in parental engagement in RPS 205. Glory be to God. Honey, I want you to pray over that. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Father, in the name of Jesus, we lift up the parents, Father, in this region, in the District 205. Yes. Father, we pray for your grace and a mm -hmm. mental capacity and a fortitude, Father, to be more involved in their children's lives, Father, as the children in their home is their first ministry, their first priority, Father. So we thank you, Lord, mm. for the conviction of the Holy Spirit, Father, mm. and insight, Lord, to be engaged, yes. to be engaged in their child's mental health, Glory to be engaged God. in their child's yes. education. And learning, Father, mm -hmm. in Jesus' name. We thank you, Father, for 
a like a a, a righteous relationship, Father, between the parents mm. and the the school, the teachers, the principals, Father, and line of communication where there's no strife, division, or confusion or misunderstanding. Yes. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Um, I see uh, chaos at a concert. Chaos at a concert. We need to be praying over a concert. Um, chaos at a concert. Lord, Thank you. Where is this concert? Where is this concert? Roso alaha ya yam roso to. Um. Let's get prophetic clarity on that, and continue to pray for chaos at a concert. In the name of Jesus, your grace over the situation right now. In the name of Jesus, your grace over the situation, those that are supposed to be monitoring this thing and uh, guarding this thing, give them insight and wisdom. Brasaha Kiandro Soto. Glory be to God. Anita Lewis says, pray for granddaughter Tasha Wazna. Um malignant tumor on her liver will need surgery next week in Jesus mighty name honey pray over that thing hallelujah father we thank you lord for your grace and your mercy a mm. miracle in Anita's granddaughter yes father we thank you lord that this malignant tumor dries up and leaves her body yes it dissolves Woo. dry up we send the word of God, and we thank you, Lord, for miracles, signs, and wonders in Jesus' name. What we have to remember, see, this is why we're praying. What we have to remember is the name of Jesus is greater than all sickness and disease, no matter what it is. What you have to remember is Mark's gospel. Chapter 1, verse 40. Now a leper came to him, imploring him, kneeling down to him, and saying to him, If you are willing, you can make me clean. Then Jesus moved with compassion, stretched out his hand and touched him, and said to him, I am willing, be cleansed. As soon as he had spoken, Immediately, the leprosy left him. The leprosy left the man. Amen. The leprosy left. Woo! Amen. The leprosy left him. Yes. The leprosy yes. left him. Yes, yes, yes. These tumors and this this granddaughter and this this boy Liam. They leave them. Leave now in Jesus. Leave now in Jesus' name. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Good morning, Jacqueline Johnson. Hey, Tishahana, good morning to you. God bless you. Glory be to God. Yambro siti asaha yambeki. Yo kalasi. Yo kalasi. Yo kalasi. Minister Marsha Rice says, please pray that the Lord strengthen my legs. Honey, I want you to pray over that. Father, we partner in prayer with Minister Marsha. We thank you, Father. Her strength in her legs, Father, in the name of Jesus. Mm. We thank you, Father, that all nerves and muscles, Father, respond to the word of God. Whatever trauma and injury that was done, it is reversed. We thank you, Father, that the word of God, which is living and powerful and alive and active. Yes. 
is flowing through her body, working Woo! a miracle. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Good morning, Artis and Bethany Simmons. Good morning to you guys. God bless you. Rosolaha yam ya kiam bro sutia hata. Neokolo city. Uh, Denise Pearson says, please pray for healing of an ear infection. Honey, pray over that. Father, in the name of Jesus, we partner with Denise in prayer. Lord, mm. we send the word of God. Mm. And we thank you, Lord, that the word of God is flowing, uh -huh. healing right now. Right now, it dries up in the name of Jesus. And we rebuke any pain, yes. any residue, and any side effect immediately. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Yamro Sulalaha. Yandro Asata. Put your prayer request on the timeline. All right. Elder Stephen Taylor, please pray for my vision to be restored. I have an appointment with. I specialist Tuesday afternoon to get them dilated. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Yes, glory be to God. Healing over the cornea, over the retina, the pupil, the entire eye, the iris. Perfect vision. Woo! Rasatalaha. Right now. In the name of Jesus. Right now, over Elder Stephen, right now. In the name of Jesus, right now. In the name of Jesus. See, when we pray, see, he says this. Mark 11, 24, 23. For surely I say to you, whoever, well, be part of that, verse 22. Have faith in God. Have the God kind of faith. For surely I say to you, whoever says to this mountain, be removed and be cast in the sea, and does not doubt in his heart, but believes those things he says will be done, he will have whatever he says. Therefore I say to you, whatever things you ask, when you pray, Believe that you receive them and you'll have them. So we have to believe right now. Amen. We're talking about miracles, signs, and wonders. Lord God, we believe you for them. Yes, Lord. Heal it. In the name of Jesus. Honey, I want you to pray for healing over our bodies. Come against all sickness and disease. And pray that our bodies have to line up to the word of God. Glory Hallelujah. be to God. Father, in the name of Jesus, yes. we thank you, Lord, for your word as yes. your covenant people, Father. Mm. We thank you, Father, that by the stripes of Jesus Christ, we are healed. That is our covenant, Father. It belongs to us, Father. Mm. We don't claim anything else. And we thank you, Father, thank that you. the blood of Jesus regenerates our DNA. Yes. We don't care what is in our bloodline. We Woo. don't care what ran through our family. It doesn't run through the family of Jesus Christ. Uh -huh. So we reject it. We submit to God. We resist the devil. And the devil has to flee. Has to we, flee. He has to flee. We resist his sickness, our body is not confused, our immune system is not confused, our soul is not confused, we resist the devil's sickness, 
the devil's infirmity. Yes. We resist it and it has to leave our bodies. Mm. We don't claim it and we repent and renounce any curse, mm. any sickness that we have claimed as ours or as mine. Yes. It is not my, our covenant is that we are the healed oh, and yes. the beloved. Yes. In the name of in Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Right now, we need to believe God for salvation over our family members. Father, we call on our family members right now. We call them into the kingdom. We call them into the kingdom. Salvation belongs to our God. And we declare that over our family and friends, co-workers, neighbors, associates, those that we do business with. We pray salvation over them. Yes. Give them dreams in the midnight hour. Give them visions. Lord God, speak to their hearts. We yes. come against a hardened heart. We come against the spirit of religion. Yes. We come against the spirit of religion yes. and tradition. We come against a hardened heart. Yes. And we pray, Lord God, Rasalaha, salvation, salvation. Respond to the word of God. Yes, Lord. We pray that their hearts be convicted in the name of Jesus. Drawn to repentance. Yes, we Lord. want them to be saved. Water baptized. Filled with the Holy Ghost with the evidence of speaking in tongues. We declare that over our friends and our family members in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Honey, I want you to pray against... Um, destruction and accidents, freak accidents over God's people. The Bible says we've been redeemed from the hand of the enemy. I want you to pray against tragedy, car accidents, come against accidents, household accidents, come against, you know, uh, being out and about and there being uh, calamity coming out in those areas, wherever they are. Pray that the angels of the Lord we thank the Lord that they encamp about us. Hallelujah. And that the blood of Jesus covers us. We will never suffer calamity and destruction in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Father, in the name of Jesus, yeah. I lift up, we partner in faith and in prayer mm -hmm. with the people of God, Lord, that we hold on and we believe in the word of God. We yeah. believe in the blood of Jesus. We yes. believe that angels protect us and yes. cover us. We believe that no evil will befall us. Mm. No destruction will come near our dwelling. Yeah. We believe, Father, that angels encamp around us to shield us and protect us. We believe that the Holy Spirit goes before us yes. and paves the way in Jesus' name. We rebuke any accidents, mm. any freakish accidents, Father, mm. whether it's in public or at home, Father. Yes. Falling, tripping, and falling, tripping over things, falling down the stairs, mm. Father. Accidental cuttings and burns and, yes. and accidental, Father, uh, cooking fires and different things like yes. that, Father. We pray that people of God are aware. Mm. They are focused. Mm. They're not aloof. In the name of Jesus, we Lord. pray that they are sober and vigilant, Father, and aware. We rebuke, Father, the, the deaf and dumb spirit, mm. Lord, that causes people of God to be asleep. Mm. It causes them to be asleep and not aware. Yes. We rebuke calamity yes. and demonic manifestations Rasa. of people when they are out in public, Father. Yes. They manifest to cause drama and to cause issues and to try to provoke the people of God. Mm. We thank you, Lord, that angels of God protect us and that the Holy Spirit restrains us to walk in the fruit of the Spirit in the name of Jesus. Mm. We pray, Father, that our spiritual discernment is keen yes. and sharp to disturbances and shifts in the spirit realm, and we pay attention Lord in God. the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Uh, Gretchen says, pray over my brother-in-law 
Tejas Hudson, he's a construction truck driver, safety. We pray over him, safety in the name of Jesus. We pray over him, safety in the name of Jesus. Glory be to God. Uh, Elder Tracy Carr says, pray for safe travel. Yes. Um, Pastor Carr and Elder Tracy Carr are going to see Caleb is graduating. Yes. Glory be to God from yes, college. Yes, yes. And we pray safe travel. Yes. There and back and everywhere in between. Yes. Safe travel over your people. Yes, Lord. Coming and going. Yes, yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah. In the name of Jesus. Jesus name. Uh, let's see. Yeah. 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 See, the word says we've been redeemed yes. from the curse. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Redeemed from the hand of the yes, enemy. We yes, and we, we have angels. We have angels. Glory to God. Um, that's right, Gretchen. Salvation of our family and friends. Hallelujah. Roso la la ha ya yam roso. Linda Tripp says, pray for Moses Lockhart. They called me and said he was in the hospital. They think someone had beaten him real bad. Here, God. Dear God. Dear God. Your grace over this man. Yes, Lord. Father, let an investigation come yes. forth and let the truth come out. Yes, Lord. Let the truth come out in the name of Jesus. Um, Bethany Simmons says, Please pray for my friend Laura and her children for peace and strength in their minds. Please continue to lift up my teenage son Gideon for strength. Pray for our family as well. Honey, I want you to pray over that. Hallelujah. Father, we partner with Bethany in prayer, Lord, over her friend Laura and her yes. children. Father, we thank you, Lord, for your grace and your yes. mercy, your love, the tangible presence of God. Father, to protect them, restore them, strengthen them, In the and heal them. Father, we lift up Gideon. Yes. Lord, we thank you, Father, for a tangible encounter with the love of God. Hallelujah. A tangible encounter. Visit him in his sleep. Father, when his senses are down, visit him, Father. Mm. Restore his soul, Father. In Jesus' name, Glory. we thank you, Father, that he will serve you with his life in Jesus' name a complete turnaround. And Father, we lift up the sentence. Father, we thank you, Lord, for your grace and your mercy. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Your Lord, grace Lord, Lord, Lord. and your mercy. Your love and your joy and your peace. Tangible. Tangible in their home. In Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus. Um, Mary Bowen says, pray for my granddaughter, Nevaeh, that she may know that God loves her, and then she will be able to love herself. Honey, pray over her. Father, we lift up Nevaeh. Mm. Father, we pray for your grace over her mind, whatever mm. she's been exposed to, whatever's been spoken over her, whatever she's seen, whatever she's done, or whatever was done to her, Father. We thank you, Lord, for the grace of God to be over her mind. Yeah. We thank you, Lord, that her soul is restored and that she senses and she feels the love of God, Lord, the love of God in her sleep, the love of God in her dreams, mm. Father, and it starts to understand undo and eradicate and and I see like a like it dissolves the mm. hurt and the trauma and the things that have been spoken like there's words that have been spoken over her that mm. has like rearranged her image mm. and so in the name of Jesus we thank you Lord for healing and restoration that the love of God restores her soul yes we rebuke the devil in the name of Jesus, off her mind. In Jesus' name. Glory to God. Pat Walter says, Please pray against idolatry from Jehovah Witness who have moved in here as Christians here continue to minister that ears will be close to their lives. 
Well, we pray salvation over the Jehovah Witnesses. We pray that they know Jesus in Jesus' name. Glory be to God. Uh, Gretchen Hudson says, pray for my granddaughter Madison as she is going to college this spring, Georgia State. Hallelujah. We pray over her. We pray salvation over her. And we pray protection and grace over her in the name of Jesus. Glory be to God. Um, Gretchen Hudson says, pray for the Pickett family. He has uh, lost his daughter. Yeah, Gretchen, we have been praying for him and the men have been reaching out and just ministering to them. And uh, thank you so much. Please continue to keep him up in prayer and them up in prayer. And we thank God for his love and grace over them. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Um, Elder Tracy Carr says, Pray for stability in the people of God and delivers them from unhealthy loyalty to manipulative religious people. Dear God, go Dear ahead. God. Pray over that. Hallelujah. Father, in the name of Jesus, yeah. we partner with Elder Tracy in prayer and yeah. his prayer request for stability in the people of God and deliver them from unhealthy loyalty to manipulative religious people. Father, in the name of Jesus, mm -hmm. we rebuke this deceptive spirit, mm -hmm. this religious demon, the spirit of witchcraft, mm -hmm. a bewitching spirit. Father, the spirit of Jezebel. Father, the spirit of Ahab, Hallelujah. lying spirits, seductive spirits, Father, spirits of ultimatums, word curses, Father, that have been spoken over people of God. We thank you, Father, that these unhealthy loyalties are broken right now and severed with the sword of the spirit. We thank you, Father, that these people come to themselves and they escape out of the snare of the devil. Father, literal escape. That's what I see by the Spirit of God that they escape out of the grips of Satan and that they pick up and run in the name of Jesus. The same way that Joshua ran, Joseph, he ran. They escape out of the grips of these manipulative tactics and word curses in the name of Jesus. Father, right now we pray for all of the victims. Yes, Lord. And the families of yes, people Lord. lost. Yes, Lord. Over senseless gunfire. Yes, Lord. And violence. Shootings. Lord God, keep your people safe. Your grace over these people right now. Your grace over the families that have lost loved ones. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Oh, yeah, 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 Right now, pray against a school mass shooting. Right now, pray against a school mass shooting. The plot and the plan is going on as we speak now. Yep. Yep. Father, right now, wherever this is, we come against it. We, Lord, expose it. Expose, 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 expose. Catch them in the act. Catch them. They got a tip in the name of Jesus. They got a tip. They got, they figured it out. Lord God, catch them in the act. Your grace and mercy in Jesus' mighty name. 
we come against this. In Jesus' name. You will see, saith the Lord, calls for division and separation in this country. Calls for division and separation. It will be more pronounced. It will be more echoed. It will be very, very clear. Calls for division and separation, saith the Lord. Yamrasatalalaha. Kiamrosoto narasi kiamrosoto. And even you will hear of more outrageous conspiracy theories. And the false prophets will be louder than they've ever been before. Ah! Yeah. The false prophets will be louder than they ever have been before. Yamroso lalaha tiamroso ko ya ki tiamrasa talaha ye androso ko amrasiri androso amrasiri amroso amrasiri amroso right now over President Joe Biden, Dr. Jill Biden, Vice President Kamala Harris, Second Gentleman Doug Emhoff, Protection and Grace, Lord God, Wisdom and Knowledge and Understanding. Yeah, Rosulalaha. Yeah, Rosulalaha. Grace right now in the name of Jesus. Grace right now. Salvation and grace. Salvation and grace in the name of Jesus. Salvation and grace in the name of Jesus. Lord God, we pray for those people that were... There was this uh, dust storm in Illinois somewhere, I-55. And they had, um, if I'm correct, about six people died. There was a pile up. Lord God, your grace over those people. They lost family members and friends. Jesus. Your grace over them in the name of Jesus. Those that are injured. Father, those that have recently lost their lives because of weather-related scenarios. In the name of Jesus, your grace, your grace, your grace, your grace, your grace. Your grace. Oh, la la city, amar la sata. Oh, la la city, amar la sata. Oh, la la city, amar la 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 ha. Pray for the weather in the month of May. Pray for the weather in the month of May. We are in the month of May. Pray for the weather. I uh, just pray God's grace. Um, listen, from a knowledge and scientific perspective, we know that the month of May can be um, very challenging for weather. Lots of tornadoes and things of that nature. So, so... We know that just from a scientific perspective and knowledge perspective. But I'm hearing from the prophetic perspective. Pray over the month of May for the weather. And Lord God, we pray over the month of May for weather. Keep your people safe yes. and protected. Yes. Lord God, in the name of Jesus. All right, honey, pray over our money. Hallelujah. Pray over our money. 
in the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Father, in Jesus' name, we partner with the people of God over their finances, Lord. We know and we believe that the blessing of the Lord makes us rich and adds no sorrow with it. We believe, Father, that we are Abraham's seed, heirs according to the promise of God. That's what it says in Galatians 3, 9. So it belongs to us, Father. We thank you, Lord, for favor with people because we have favor with God. We thank you, Father, that money belongs to us. It comes to us now in the name of Jesus. We thank you, Father, for wisdom, downloads, and knowledge from heaven. We thank you, Lord, for creative ideas and witty inventions. We thank you, Father, that we have an excellent, surpassing spirit. We thank you, Father, that we walk in the fruit of the spirit and we crucify our flesh with its passions and desires. We thank you, Heavenly Father, that doors are open that no man can shut. We thank you, Heavenly Father, for bringing every mountain low and every valley high and making every crooked place straight and rough paths smooth for the people of God. We thank you, Father, that... Uh, that blockades and obstructions, Father, are removed, loopholes bent in our favor in the name of Jesus. Contracts, Father, client agreements increase, exposure, influence in the name of Jesus for the people of God. Yes. The wealth of the wicked that belongs to us, it comes to us right now in the name of Jesus. The money that belonged to our ancestors, Father, mm. that worked the field, Father, that were on the plantation, and they never received money, they mm. never received land, Father, yeah. they yeah. never received what was belonged to them. Yeah. It cries out to you to get to us. Mm. It belongs to your people, Father, and we call it to us in the name of Jesus. Glory be to God. Um, praise God they caught that. The stabber yes. at that university, serial killer. He was a former student. See, the devil is in him. The devil is in him, and you have and and we have to pray. We have to pray against things like that. See, so praise God that they caught Amen. him. Praise God that they caught him. Um, I told you to continue to pray for the debt ceiling negotiations. Continue to pray God's grace over it. How do you pray over something like that? Do you pray, Lord God, let the negotiations go through? Do you pray, uh, Lord, let the Republicans get what they want? Do you pray, Lord, let... President Biden and the Democrats get what they want. Do you pray that the debt ceiling gets taken care of and and they they the, the U.S. does not um, default on its on its you know on the financial on its loans and all of that stuff default on its creditors? Do you pray? Well, how do you pray over that? And this is what the Lord said to me: Pray God's grace. Yeah. That's what you pray. Pray His grace. You hear me say that a lot? Pray God's grace over the situation. Yes, yes. Because what we have to remember is there's something called God's prophetic agenda. Yeah. And we want to make sure that we're praying in alignment with God's prophetic agenda. It We can't get it caught up in the, well, I'm going to choose this side. I'm going to choose this side. we got to remember we're kingdom citizens. And there's God's prophetic agenda. So we're praying God's grace over the situation. Yeah. If it does default and they don't come to terms, God's great. we need God's grace. If it does, they still need God's grace. See? So pray God's grace over that situation. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We have Family Sunday this Sunday at 11 a.m. It is a um, dress casual Sunday, wear your EWCC gear. We are going to have communion. Yes. We are going to have a worship and praise experience. We're going to have a great time in the presence of God. Bring your friends and family to church this Sunday. Family Sunday at 11 a.m. Bring them to church. Bring somebody to the house of God. Hallelujah. We love you with the love of the Lord. 
God bless you. God bless you. And we will see you Sunday. Amen.